Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the final episode of Sonic Story and Sonic Adventure DX. Uh, did not expect to beat this game uh, this fast, but uh, anyway, uh, I just paused right here because there was a cutscene going on, and uh, I'm sorry, but and I wasn't recording. But anyway, it was just him like saying, like, oh, I'm going to beat you with this Egg Viper. So anyway, this is the final boss. Uh, might as well get some rings over here in case I get hit, why not? And then, if, uh, yeah, <laughs> sorry. Like, just rambling nonsense and nonsense. Okay, you just gotta dodge the lasers like that, and then this is how you uh, hurt him. So yeah, you just kinda have to rinse and repeat a couple times. He does get a little different uh, uh, throughout the boss fight. But, uh, oh fuck, they're not expecting him to do another, uh, those lasers. But anyway, yeah. Um, I'm gonna tell another conversation. The conversation, I'm in another story. Um, at, uh, this is another school story as well. But, uh, I've been noticing uh, this a lot going uh, around school. Um, I don't know if it's just me or what, but <coughs> excuse me. Um, every time I would walk, like, uh, cause at school there's always someone in front of you, no matter what. And my voice cracked there. But anyway, as I'm walking, I notice people just start turning around to like look behind their back and whatnot. Oh, how did that not get me? But anyway. People are like getting really fucking paranoid and that makes me paranoid because I'm like, what the fuck? Because I don't do that. Uh, I'm just walking my, my own business and then I always notice people look behind their back. I'm like, am I really that threatening to people? That they have to like constantly look behind their back? Because it's not just like one like quick glance. It's like I look behind me and then I gotta do a double take. And then a couple of seconds later, is he still following me? And like, I don't understand that. Because I mean like, of course I gotta get to class and nine, nine times out of ten, if I'm still following you, my class is somewhere fucking right there. Uh, it's kind of turning into a little rant, but I'm sorry, I didn't mean to get so outraged with it. I'm not really raging, but uh, I'm just like really trying to <laughs> project my voice and uh, nonsense. But it's just really weird to me, because like, I don't do that. Like, I don't fucking look behind my back constantly, because I don't give two flux about anything. This is the other thing I was talking about, that he does that, and then uh, that's how they change it up a bit. And then he does one last thing, but you'll see that in a second. Oh yeah, he destroys that, so now you're just stuck on this one playing field, so you won't be doing the jumpy roos anymore. But anyway, uh, is he gonna do that? Okay, yeah. So that's just like really weird to see people being really paranoid about stuff. I don't know if that's just like um, them being paranoid or what have you, but it's just I've just noticed that happen a lot. Uh, so just really wanted to shed some light on that because uh, I don't fucking understand it. But anyway, so with that little rambling nonsense, we uh, beat this, or so we think. He's gonna try to attack us one last time, and uh, how you dodge that is uh, once you see him like coming towards you, like that, you just kind of run away. So yeah, whenever oh, oh okay, that scared me. I thought he hadn't done it yet. But anyway, as a, as a little kid, I was like, oh my gosh, and I I would die like a couple times before I would really uh, get when he's gonna dive towards me, but. With that, we are done with Sonic Story. Uh, I don't know what to do next, cause uh, this is like the first game I've ever beaten this. So yeah. Uh, by the way, I'm recording this in like this. This is the second batch of like episodes I'm recording, so that's why it's taken a, a long time for me to update the rest of the Fall Play series. And I didn't really intend for that to be uh, its own thing, like a uh, Fall Plays episodes more than just two or something. Cause I just thought like, hey, we haven't put anything out for a while. Uh, let's try. Uh, let's, I'm, uh, <laughs> rambling. I mean, just I don't know. I'm just kind of like still trying to get used to this solo commentating thing. So hopefully, I've been getting better with like each iteration of Fall Place. But back to the topic at hand, cause I, I just go on tangents like every two fucking seconds. But anyway, uh, this is a good song. I like it by the way. Hope I don't get flagged though. <laughs> is Sonic trying to sing? Is he singing this? I thought it was Crush 40. But anyway, um, woo, that's gonna be the thumbnail. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, this is the actual credits and whatnot. Just gonna show you all throughout the stages and whatnot. You could uh, see that for a while. I'm just gonna talk for a little second. Well, that scared me. Apparently some Twitch guy uh, streams right now. But anyway, um, back to the topic at hand I was trying to explain. Uh, originally my plan with uh, Fall Plays was just like a, its own little one-off thing that uh, I just did just to get some like thing out there and like sort of try my hand at solo commentating because I'm not the best at it. I'm pretty sure you've noticed uh, 
from the previous um, episodes and whatnot. But I've been trying, you know, I, I was nervous the first time, especially because uh, my parents were like right over there. So I was still kind of like on the edge of like, they're gonna think I'm crazy. And what is this newfangled nonsense of commentating for the internet? And I already got thirsty mid sentence. And uh, so yeah, I was just like, this is just gonna be weird. But uh, I've, I've talked to my parents about that, and they're like, ah, fuck it, you, you youngins do what you do. And so I've just been, uh, I've been taking that with like, uh, courage, I guess. So I'm just trying to do this, and uh, it's just kind of weird. It's, I never thought it'd be like, not hard, but yeah, hard, I guess, for lack of a better word, to talk to people. Well, not, well, yeah, I'm talking to you guys right now. But it's just weird, like playing a game, focusing on it, and making it, uh, actually, I just bumped the mic there for a second, making it uh, look entertaining and as well as my commentary. But uh, it's been a little struggle, but I think I'm getting better. I've been like talking more and like not just be like, hey, I'm just, I'm just gonna do the bit. So hopefully I'm just, you know, gonna keep doing this because it uh, seems like people are watching. So it makes me have enthusiasm for once. And instead of like the first episode, I was just like, Ooh, like I said. But anyway, it's just kind of a mo it's a big milestone for me. I've completed a game, well, sort of. I beat one part of a game, but it's, I made it to the credits. So that's something uh, that's never happened except for that one time when uh, we beat uh, Link to the Past. Because that was a good episode. <laughs> we beat our first go play, and uh, this is my first uh, fall play that I've beaten, quote unquote. I don't know if I'll tackle this again. Uh, either in like a fall place or maybe even a dual play we might just revisit it and rebrand it as a dual play and finish the rest of it off but uh i don't know for now i'm just gonna take it easy and uh do what i do for now and kind of finish up spongebob because that one's uh, uh, a good one as well though beautiful joe i'm probably not gonna continue past episode three because uh i don't know i just i feel like that's gonna be lacking in terms of like quality and like uh, entertainment, I guess, because I don't think that people want to watch it, but correct me if I'm wrong, but, um, I'll see how that goes, eh, if we do, just, if I do decide to, like, continue it, I don't know, I'll probably just make it a dual play and, uh, switch it up a bit just to make it more interesting, but yeah, Spongebob and Sonic, I'm gonna continue, well, Sonic, not really much, because I'm done with this, and I didn't, I didn't plan on 100% of the game or whatnot, but uh, if people still want it, well then I'll continue the rest of the things until Supersonic and then beat the game, like, for realsies. But for now, I'm just gonna focus on Spongebob, trying to at least, I don't know if I should finish that as well, but uh, I'm gonna at least try to get to the first boss and see how that will go. And uh, hopefully this will kind of give you an, uh, uh, a look into the behind the scenes of like how I record this, because I haven't even begun Spongebob yet. Uh, at the time of this, but uh, who knows? Maybe in, I have. Maybe this will be the last episode of the fall players, and you'll be like, "What?" I doubt it, because that'll make no fucking sense. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this little rambling nonsense of rants and whatnot. Not really much of an interesting uh, topic, I guess, because it's just maybe more or less like an update kind of thing. But anyway, we beat the Sonic story. I've had fun, this game was fun, I had surprisingly, um, I mean, what the fuck, words, sentences, I need to use them, uh, this wasn't as tough as I originally thought, like, well, then again, this game isn't really that tough, but I thought because of the whole, like, wait a minute, wait a minute, no, okay, oh, 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 for a second that I wasn't recording, <laughs> oh, that would have been super bad, super bad, but anyway, uh, this is like surprisingly easy because the whole let's play curse and I thought I was just gonna be fucking things up left and right But apparently I didn't so I feel good about myself. Uh, let me see if I could show something off here uh, well, Once you once you beat the game with like a character you unlock mission mode and what this is I'll just quickly show this off just to make this uh, I guess filler I guess but Halloween's been over for like a year but anyway, mission mode is basically, uh, you're going around, uh, everywhere, and you're collecting this things, which if I could, um, quickly get one, if I so desire, if Sonic desires, come on. Okay, made it up here. 
Then you just get it. This is mission 28. During the morning traffic, you use the fountain to get to the balloon. Uh, basically, it just gives you a clue as to like what you're supposed to do uh, to beat the mission. And I think there's like 90 missions, uh, I think. Is this the way to go? This is Radical Highway, right? Oh, Speed Highway. Wait. Okay, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. Radical Highway is the other one from Sonic Adventure 2. Anyway, uh, this mission is basically saying like uh, the traffic and the fountain. So, at first thought, uh, glance, whatever, you would think like traffic uh, in Station Square because that's where like cars are. But if you also remember, uh, there's a fountain at the end of this place with cars surrounding it. So I think that's where it, it's telling me to go. So I'm gonna quickly get there and uh, I'm gonna cut ahead because you've seen this before probably. And so I'll just cut ahead and show. Oh my fucking gosh! So that's what the inside of that building looks like. And we've made it to this part which I was talking about. So, um, I'm just gonna make it to the fountain. So, I think it's over where? It's over yonder here. If I could just get up here. Alright, thank you, little stepping stone. Okay, and I didn't mean to fall there. Okay, so it's this way. Alright, here's the car, so I guess, uh, traffic stuff. So, that makes sense. So, we just gotta turn the corner or fall down, you know. Same diff. Fucking, oh my god, I've never had this much of a problem with homing attacks. I, okay, maybe that's, that was, maybe that, that was my, my last play curse. I never had good uh, times with the homing attacks and whatnot. Okay, so I have to wait for it to go like boner if I itself okay, like it is right now. Get to the, okay then. <laughs> it's turning into the Amy levels. Come on. Are you fucking kidding me? Depth perception? Work with me. Alright, is it boner? Yeah, okay. Come on, I could get fucking me. Okay, can I just do this? No, wait, maybe. Never give up. Fucking, okay, maybe I gotta give up. And eh, no, okay. Alright, fountain, work with me here. Alright, come on. Come on, it looks good. Fuck! I'm overshooting it too much. God damn it. Okay, here we go. Take 503. Come on. No, not even close. Come on. Okay, it wasn't even. It wasn't even erect yet. Alright, come on. Okay, maybe if I just like tease it in there. Come on, get it in there. Fucking did it. <laughs> mission 28 clear, and that's what happens when you clear a mission. And uh, yeah, if you clear all the missions, uh, uh, you get um, bonus stuff like uh, emblems and whatnot. Uh, this is what I get if I complete this uh, over again. Do I beat it with uh, mission B or did I miss? Oh, I know it's mission mode. Um, that doesn't count. So anyway. That's what mission mode is, and you gotta do like other stuff like that, like here's mission, what is this, mission one, bring the man who's standing in front of the British up. I guess this would have been a better one to show off than the Radical highway, Speed Highway one, but whatever. It, it, at least if you didn't know what mission 28 was, now you know. And mission one is just to bring this glitchy motherfucker to the circle, if I could even get him. Come on, come on, there we go. And I just like how you just pick him up like a little statue and just put him wherever you want. I'm doing this in front of the police as well, so like, be like, Oh, Sonic, he's helping the elderly. But I'm really gonna toss him in the ocean. Haha, <laughs> but you can't really do that. Does he... Oh, okay, so the ground eats him. Very nice to know. But yeah, it's pretty cool. And this game is fucking glitchy as well, man. You should look up a couple of uh, videos about glitches with this game, because uh, they're crazy. And they're pretty funny as well. And they're nice to try out if you have the time. I think there's like one of you could get like behind here and like go behind. My voice is going everywhere. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> oh, what the fuck was that, Sonic? Man, you could go everywhere. And it, I think glitches are uh, either the same or you could work around them and get the end result same uh, with every version. I bumped the mic again. I think with the Dreamcast, the GameCube, and the 360 and Steam versions, they all have either they all have the same glitches or they have minor differences but get the end result you know what i'm talking about you know what i mean uh so with that i i will conclude this uh fall series or sonic series whatever and thank you very much for watching again i really appreciate it really keeps me going hopefully we'll get uh wicked we could make more um dual plays because those are what we really want to do but stuff keeps interrupting us time and time again but anyway, that's another wrap for another day. Thank you guys. Uh, have a good breakfast, lunch, dinner, day and night and everything in between. See you later.